All right, Cooper and Ian back again to try another Cheetos experiment from Burger King. So first we had the mac and cheese. Mac and Cheetos. Yeah, bites, which were... Eh. Okay. Now they're back again with chicken fries. Cheetos chicken fries. I just want to stop for a moment. Right. We need to. Oh, my head's too big. Yeah, I don't know. Let's see, you could do this. What is this, made for children? Let's see, you do... No, that's not... No. But, uh, okay, so it can't be adjusted. Did you rip yours? No. Oh, maybe. Ian. Ian. Did you get it? Oh, yeah. Oh, my head is big, actually too big for this. It looks good, though. Does it? It looks funny. Good, actually. Well, maybe it's not. I just can't see behind me. Where's Josh? Oh, he's not here. Our stage assistant. I don't know. All right, this is the biggest setting. Let's see how this... Oh, there we oh, go. See, I should have done that first. Time. Why not be smart, Ian? Because you know me. You're right, I do know you. <laughs> Still the same OG. How do I look? Great. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, there we are. Oh, yeah. You look amazing. All right, let's do this. Okay, this so these are the Cheetos ones. These are the regular ones. There's no dipping sauce um, that's recommended for the Cheetos. So uh, I figured since we're taste testing anyway, it's probably better to do it without the sauce. And uh, it's also weird to note that uh, these are cheaper than the regular chicken fries. That is weird. They literally, well, I guess that's a little more red. Yeah, they, they have an oranger look to them. So. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. They, uh. Do they smell Cheeto y? They cheese smell. Dusty? They smell like there's a little bit of cheese. I actually think these smell better than the Cheetos ones do. Oh, yeah. I don't know. That's a weird smell. I'm gonna eat it anyway, though. I'm gonna take this one. There we go. Cheers. I'm reserving my thought for you because I usually go first with these. You don't get a Cheetos hint until after. Like after you swallowed and then the, um, the aftertaste comes to me anyways. Otherwise I tasted no Cheeto until everything was gone. You know what this tastes like to me? Disappointment. It really does. It, it doesn't... It tastes... It just tastes like it was fried in weird grease. It doesn't taste... I don't know. And just putting Cheetos on something, I feel like it gives it so much more like, yeah, it's going to be great, I want to try it, and then just... I'm disappointed. No. Yeah, gotta do a regular one now. Well, that one was more crispier for me. It is crispier. Not too much of a taste difference. These, they taste, uh, they taste better than the regular ones do. Yeah. No. I think it's another disappointment from Cheetos and Burger I'm King. I'm sorry, yeah, I... One out of five, five being super great. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go one. Now I'll probably go one and a half just for the crunch factor. I like that in a chicken. That's what's the crunch factor for me. Because the flavor, it, it's not an offensive flavor, but it's not a good flavor. Like, Cheetos are good. How's that? I like the crunch over here. This does have a better taste. I don't know. I wouldn't get them again, but I do like the crown. It's a nice crown. 